Hey guys, how's it going? So ever since my first goal kicking video, I've been asked how do I curl my kicks? So today I'm just gonna give you a little bit of a tutorial, I guess, on how I personally do it. Again, everything with goal kicking comes to personal preference. So this just works for me. So, you know, this will give you a bit of a base, but from this base, you've then got to try and figure out your own personal way of doing it. Right. So the first thing I recommend is that you use a bit of a bigger tee, like one that sits a bit higher off the ground with a, like a very small amount on the top. The reason for that is when you place the ball on it, you have a lot more area. Right. You can see a lot more of the ball, it's a lot easier for you to aim for, like aim for the spot that you want to aim for. Right. The second thing and the most important part is where you hit the ball. Now for me personally, I try to aim for, so if the ball's down this way, I try to aim for about this lower third here on this side. So what I do, the valve of the ball, I put that on the tee, so the ball would be sitting like this, and then this bottom third of the ball right here is where I try to connect to get the ball to swing back in that way. Right? Now me personally, when I kick, I use the knuckle of my big toe. Uh, so, you know, a lot of people say you need to use the laces of your boot, you need to use the inside of your sh of your boot, you know, all these different things. All of that comes down to personal preference. So, again, just trial and error, try it out. But the main thing is hitting the ball in that lower third just there on the side because that's what's going to get the ball to naturally swing that way. Uh, and then it just comes down to practice. Uh, where you aim the ball, again, that's up to you. Me, personally, I aim it a bit closer to the left post just to get that little bit of extra swing around. Uh, but again, that comes to personal preference. Maybe you can swing it a bit further so you can aim it about, about a bit wider. But again, that's all up to you. All right, guys, so on, honestly, that's it when it comes to swinging your kicks. It's just working, making sure you hit that lower third and make sure you're consistent with it. All right, so now I'm just gonna have a couple of shots of goal just to show you the technique. And yeah, uh, hopefully this helps some of you guys out. And um, yeah, take it easy, guys. Have a good one. That is from three kicks. All of those slips, all those divots. I'll definitely be remaking this video. 